Hi bubbly people this is bubble gum and welcome to my channel so today we are doing the full unboxing of Samsung A71 from the start to the end uh, there will be no cuts in between so as you can see it has the security seal so it does say that if the seal is broken do not accept and it is covered by a thin layer of plastic so we will just quickly go ahead and cut it out so this is a phone that I bought online so that's why it's not yet open so I just uh, received it in the morning and in the evening this has been shot so you can see it's like actually dark and uh, quickly let's go ahead and open the plastic so online they did send me a bill uh, with the packet with the packaging okay and uh, yes do not forget to subscribe to my channel so this is how it looks so usually if you go ahead and buy from the store they will go ahead and open it up and check the phone and give it to you but since it's online you just need to make sure everything is fine so yeah it was properly sealed i am just opening the seal now quickly i'm trying to be careful not to damage the product let me quickly go ahead and open it up so in the package let's see what is included but yes please do not forget to like this video so it has the imei sticker and here is the phone the galaxy a71 i have ordered the light blue color it comes in other colors as well uh, black color silver color and you see that it is like a reflective the back side so in the phone the, uh, there is a in the package there is a fast charger there is a data cable for the charger as well and also the headset so this was surprising for me because i could not find any instruction manual or anything so it was confusing i'm like why is the phone like is it incomplete the package what is the deal with it and then i realized actually the rest of the item is on the other side of the box so don't get confused like me so this is how you have to open it and here is the ejector pin and inside they have a cover as well a plastic cover which is very helpful because once you buy new phones you know you do not get uh, covers instantly so having one cover around at least even a plastic it's like very handy and your phone feels secured so this is a quick start guide uh, so in english they have it it's just simple how to put on the sim card and the memory card and all that's very basic and how to charge your phone and then you have one in thai as well since i bought it from thailand so obviously they'll have it in the local language also and obviously the warranty card so as i was saying if you buy it from the shop and they will go ahead and open up the warranty card and sign it for you and you know stamp it with a store stamp however since it's bought online obviously they did not open up the package so i have the bill separately so hopefully that works but anyway let's open up the phone so i'll take off the plastic there's a plastic covering and as i said the back cover uh, you know especially with the clear cover it will look very nice as you can see it's like a very reflective uh, uh, holographic kind of uh, effect it has so even if you buy a plain simple clear cover that will look good already you don't have to buy any fancy covers even though i, I already uh, ordered some covers online so yeah so it does take some time to go ahead and put it in securely so i'm just uh, leaving it for now i'll just quickly go ahead and switch it on so this is how it looks so the phone that i'm shooting this video with is actually samsung j8 so this is an old phone this is like a two year old phone and when i compared the sizes it's not really that big the a71 however the screen size they explain is actually much bigger than the j8 but i'll tell you how because over here you see the camera is actually just a little dot so they have utilized the entire screen they have not used like there is no uh, blank space so the entire screen is being used so that's the benefit of this one so you select uh, your preferred language here i'm selecting english united states and let's go so you need to fill up a lot of stuff actually so they will ask you for the accessibility uh, rights and everything of the phone immediately 
so i would suggest to take some time and go through it i was trying to just uh, quickly go ahead and log in uh, because i did not want to waste uh, much time going through the features which i did go through later on so i will upload some other videos as well with explaining about the features of the phone and what it has to offer so yeah if you can go ahead and choose a wi-fi network they'll give you the option and please do not forget to share this video if you like it so you can copy all your apps and data from your old phone as well so if you log in uh, and you give samsung the rights they will transfer even the old settings to the new phone so that's very handy it's very helpful so you can select the date and time and more services accessibility rights as per your preference you can go ahead and choose that and yeah protect your phone so you can choose face recognition fingerprints pattern pin password so it's preferable to go ahead and lock your phone with multiple uh you know locking options like you should have a pin and a pattern or maybe face recognition fingerprint and the pin as well so something like that so they will give you some option of recommended apps based on your profile like i uh, this is not showing it now but later on when i was going through the settings they will ask you which age group you're from and what is your gender so based on that as well they will give you some app preferences so finally it's all done so this is the main screen and it actually comes up with some pre-installed apps like facebook spotify and then you see there is netflix as well even though i don't have a netflix account so that was interesting to see so if you want you can keep these apps or you can uninstall them as well and this is the camera this is the back camera And this is the front one. So yeah, you can go ahead and change the settings as per your preference. Sorry, this is the front one. So I had not yet visited the front one. So this is it. And I'm shooting with the phone as you can see. So I will go through the camera features and all the other features of the phone as well in the upcoming videos. But for now, this is it. If you liked it, please go ahead and like it and I'll see you in the next one.